lens as Carol. So I've got to wear these dreadful things. Don't I look an embarrassment? I think I must have lost them that night I went to the play with Veronica. You remember Veronica? Yes. I was running very late and I was meeting her there. And I was running, and it was raining, it was a dreadful, it was raining cats and dogs, Carol, to use that expression, do you mind? Classic, straight out of a movie, Carol, straight out of one of those movies you like. Splash, all over my lovely cloak. They wouldn't let me into the play. Uh, Veronica was furious, she stormed off. It was a nightmare. It was a nightmare, Carol, and you were right. I shouldn't have gone. I think you said that that night. You said, stay in, the weather's atrocious. And I didn't. So, once again, you're a wise old friend. I should heed your warnings more often. Do you remember that time we were in, uh... I think it was in Espanol. Well, you were speaking in Espanol. We were in Spain, and we saw that bull. You remember? It was going in to, uh, to do whatever they do, the bull show, and, uh, well, its balls were sweating like you wouldn't believe. It was like it was a waterfall under there. Do you remember? And you said... Yes, yes, that's right! I've never laughed so hard. I'm not laughing now, but at the time it was very, very funny. Now... I think I should probably call a friend. Thomas Harris. He's in trouble. I don't want to be clear-headed right now. You mind these for me. I'll be back. Oh, careful, mate. You're going to pull the whole tree down. <laughs> That's all right, I'll be careful. <laughs> Tiles, five places. Shopping spray. What is this one? What is that? Ah, 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 ah. Yeah, 
Good morning, Greg here. Deborah's, uh, sorry, Danny's dad. Uh, it's, uh, as you know, only six days to go until uh, the big day, the audition for Neighbours. So uh, obviously I'm, I'm as proud as punch for my daughter. Uh, so are all the guys down the plant actually. She's like, uh, she's, she's like a daughter to them too since, since her mum died. Anyway, uh, today's a big day as well. This morning we've got a big promotional trip down into the city. So no doubt uh, she's been getting ready for hours. So uh, let's go and see how she's doing. Love. Let's go have a look. Doll, Deborah, love. Dad! Are you ready? Dad, what are you doing? I'm not ready yet and you're not supposed to film me like this. Oh Dolly my God. was supposed to leave five minutes ago. I was practicing the sleeping scene. It's all right. Oh my God, I look like shit, Dad, and there's no more collagen. Calm down, Bronza, 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 bloody bronza. Today I'm doing a bit of a publicity tour. Uh, what I've got is my flyer with Danny Star written on it, of course. Um, I've got this petition for people to sign to get me on Neighbours. I've got little Fronky with me. Mwah. So come on, let's go meet some people. Yeah! I'm just wondering if you can sign my petition to help me get on Neighbours, please. Sure. Where do you come from? I'm from the States. Oh my god! He's from America! Oh my god. To sign my petition to get me on Neighbours. Just there, just there. Hi, would you like to have one of my clients? I'm auditioning for this role. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, that's good. I mean, the people were so nice. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, no way. Aren't you like that hot chick, like Paris Hilton type person, like everyone's talking about you and all that? Can we get your autograph? Sure, boys, sure. Um, so who should I make it out to? Well, that's me, I'm your brother, Todd, you idiot. Dad, can we please cut that bit out? Because I don't want anyone knowing that he's my brother. Come on, Danny, just sign it, please, love. Dear Todd and Scott. Scott. Danny. Hey, isn't your name Deborah? Come on, Dad. Hey, what about the money? Hey, where's our money? You said you give us 20 bucks for that. Todd, don't do this to me! Money. Whatever, look, give us the 20 bucks and we're gonna tell everyone about your filthy dreams you have with Harold and all that, you know? Huh. Just take it. Woo. Come on, Dad, let's go. Yep, yep all right. Hello, Linda. Snacky house. 
far to go. The rest, it's a van. Are you all ten and bound? The taxi drives her. I don't know nobody named Iris. Reserve those dogs. Get her cars, Harry. Plato on. Army. North or Blunder Zone. Breathtaking. Ricky. Ricky goes to town. I can't understand a word. Barricka. Reagan ball. Girl's bum. Visible nakedness. Girl with apple. Erry, uh, no. It's about a painting. Terrific. Popcorn. A strobe boy. Remarkable. Al. Ian. Bums Bandits. Starring Nicole. You kidding, man? E.T. The Extra Terry's Trial. Terrible finish. Leon Hard. PR6. Three stars? Mate, you alright in there? <coughs> yeah, I'm alright, mate. Kalista, oh Kalista, are you the one that will melt my goth heart and make me whole again? The dagger of love and the the hearts they hey, melt. Tell me what you're doing. Composing one of your famous monologues again? Yeah. Oh sweet man, I love them. You know how this was? Football training. You know what I mean? You wouldn't believe it. I turn up there, they say, hey, Jim, you know, you can't wear black no more. I said, I gotta wear black, I'm a goth, you know? Head to toe, one color, yo, black, that's me. They said to me, nah, look, we got new yellow uniforms. I say, yellow, I'm not gonna wear a yellow uniform. Oh my god, look at me. I said, nah, I'm gonna wear purple, maybe a little bit of white. Predominantly, I'll wear black. Pretty much only black. I said to him, hey, if I can't wear black, I'm not gonna be on the team. They said to me, fine, don't be on the team. I said, fine, screw you later. You know, it's madness, you know what I mean? Madness. No. Look, Jim, I gotta tell you something. I think I'm in love with Kalista. Love? I don't even know if I can compute that word. I mean, do us gods even believe in love? I don't know. I know you tell me you don't know. Man, what am I gonna do? Hmm. Hey, hey, hey! Ah. You, was, you just wanna start a goth football team? Just us goths. We can wear black. Yeah, sure. No, no, Let's no, sure. I thought I told you guys to stay out of my space. I think it sounds pretty good. It doesn't sound pretty good, Louis. It sounds pretty bad. I think you got that wrong. Listen, we don't. We don't do soccer or whatever you want to play. I have played handball, and yes, I have played badminton with friends. But we do not play ethnic games, okay? We sit and uh, we, we read, or we, or we journal, okay? Or we, we blog when my brother is not on the computer, which he always is. Louie, can't you see these guys are freaks? Maybe we should leave, Jim. There's obviously not enough room for another bun in this coven. We'll go share our sorrow with someone else. Come on, let's go. Yeah. Say hi to Mrs. Cacciatore for me. It's Cacciolina. Hey, Louis. Training tomorrow at five, right? Being short, a t-shirt, maybe a water bottle. We'll get burgers afterwards, yeah? The darkness. I can feel it. Callista, where is your soul? I'm so confused. What am I going to do? Hi. Hi. What are you doing? Just writing. More poetry? It's all I have. Can I read it? No, nah, it's too personal. Read it to me. This is Ode to My Black Soul. The loneliness is deep in my soul, searing, trembling. I am mocked by foolish mortals. 
Wild hair permeates forth like pasta putanesca. You're really special, you know that? Really? Really. Really. There I lift the sweet dark veil of love. Oh, I totally stoned the chick, man. Oh, man, there's blood on the ball. How funny is that? Oh, and here we are at the easel. Have a look at the canvas. What is it? It's in landscape style. It's time to do a beautiful landscape. I've got the tools of the trade. I hope you're all ready and ready to roll. Let's get started. Here we go. So this is my horizon line. Yes, it is. Oh, yes. Yes. Hold oh, it steady. Just hold it very steady. And just let it. Just let it flow into the canvas, and you. You really. You really find that there's a really I'm creating this landscape. There's deep, there's there's a foreground, background, mountain background, mini steps, and of course flying machine. Yeah. <laughs> Need some dandruff control! No locking contracts! No stamp duty! No locking contracts! Just a locking contract! Oh! Hey doll, I'm Carl! 681540R I'm your South African sweetheart, ready to drop some sweet sugar right on your tongue. You know what? Talk is cheap. Love is too expensive. But music, <laughs> well music makes the world go round. Check out this divine love song I crafted especially for you. It's sure to remind you exactly what love's got to do, got to do with it. So here goes something. What is called car crash love? Yeah. My love's like the wreck of a car. My love's like the wreck of a car. My love's like the wreck of a car. My love is like the wreck of a car. So here it comes now. What I want is what you got. What I need is what I want. What I want is what you got. What I need is what I want. My love's like the wreck of a car. What I want is what you got. My love's like the wreck of a car. My love is like the wreck of a car. My love is like the wreck of a car. Stop sign. Yield, girl. Oh, look out. Look All out, right. baby. I'm going to write it off right write now. Off, yeah. Right off. My love is like a brick of a car. My love is like a brick of a car. Look out. Divine. My love is like a brick of a car. My love is like a brick of a car. My love is like a brick of a car. My love is like a brick of a car. My love is like a brick of a car. My love is like a brick of a car. My love is like a brick of a car. My love is like a brick of a car. My love is like a brick of a car. My love is like a brick of a car. Love is like the wreck of a car. Huh? 
high. Danny showed us today just how wrong things can go when you start to lie about who you are. For every lie that you tell, you have to tell 10 lies to cover it up. All right, sometimes 11, but the point is, the more complex your web of lies becomes, the more likely it is that you'll end up having to pay kickbacks to all sorts of shady characters, while you spiral out of control, trying to support your cocaine habit by turning tricks for politicians, fish and chip shop owners, and carnies alike. So remember, when you tell a lie to someone, you're actually lying to yourself, as well as lying to them. At the, the lie that you told them is the same lie for you and for them. See you next week. Really perfectly, didn't it? Just, that was amazing. Yeah.